Hello and welcome back to Judgment. So last time uh, we heard a cry for help and uh, we have to help him. That person. Whoever that person might be. One well, for sure, we need to be damn careful. Of the people in, in town. Damn, possessed guys and whatnot. I need to get some better weapons. I've lost too many guys. It's enough. And Timmy's doing nothing. I'm pretty sure that he's not getting any experience either because all he's doing is just hiding in the back and waiting for others to do the job. Are you getting experience, Timmy? I don't think so. Stephanie joined the team after Timmy. And she's almost as experienced as Timmy. <laughs> Timmy's not getting much experience. That's, that's a bit of a problem. Even if I could make a character like super tanky. It just never happens because uh, she just... It, that character just never gets the experience because... Uh, gets no kills. <laughs> At least it looks like it. Uh oh. June! Welcome! What are you? A scout? Uh, you're welcome. Uh, let's all go back home. Why not? Not sure what is the maximum team size? Rescued! Great. Do I wanna keep screwing around here? Or just say screw it and go away? Uh, that might be it. I'll just go back home. Uh, see what June is all about. So June is a hobo. Uh, scavenging speed and movement speed. And Vernus generation. Wow. Uh, great. Uh, I guess the movement speed is an indirect. Well, it's a it's a buff to work efficiency. Could be even useful in a fight, but more likely it's a work efficiency buff. And, uh, I think she's gonna be a fighter. Archery, auto weapons, evasion, marksmanship, pistols, quarrying, yeah, yeah. She can be a fighter, she should be a fighter. Oh. Level ups. Set the engineer, who's getting better at crafting. Bart, who's not sure what to get better at. And June, who probably should just get some weapons. Uh, or anything. How big is the... Team I can take? June. Oh, I can only send a maximum of five survivors on the mission. Okay. I got ya. Actually, that's not true. Because there's a tech I can go for that allows me to take six. Task for size plus one. Let's do it. Uh, yeah, that, that's gonna help, I suppose. If I can find it. Uh, manage. We can take June as well. Approved. So it's a six man team. But that's actually the the maximum. Oh, a trader? Wow, that could be really good. What is that? Elemental bomb? Shotgun? Low range? Terrible DPS? What's the point? Oh, high burst damage. And high accuracy. I don't know. Doesn't seem that good to me. A Tommy gun seems good, but what the hell? Compared to the SMG. Oh yeah, the SMG is a lot less accurate. 
But the Tommy gun is so much more expensive. A flare gun. That's very pricey too. We can even buy research materials. Holy words. I can't buy that. I wish I could. I would. <laughs> I can't. Yeah, that, it's not even close. I can't buy it. It's not gonna happen. Yep. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Water is running out? Uh, that's terrible news. Stefan is collecting here, so I guess that's something. Maybe I should have another bell. Like over there. And build two more farms, wheat farms, veggie farms, I don't know. matter do I need both or do I need only one I can make sandwiches now uh, I don't have to make bread cell value it has the same cell value tier 2 food it doesn't need drinking water or wood, it needs wood. It needs veggies and wheat. Sandwich times two. Same time to, same time to make it. I don't get it. Uh, what more info? Like, it seems like salad is the best. This is just a, a combination. This is the most pricey one. Hmm, don't know. June? Wait a second. Uh, I probably should just change June's priorities. She likes searching debris. Great. Uh, yeah, we didn't have a guy who did that. So, yeah, knock yourself out. Uh, might as well do some of the, those tasks as well. But you, yeah, you're definitely gonna be a fighter. Marksmanship, sure. Okay. So do I have enough resources to actually head out? Oh, assistance needed? Jeez. Mm. Okay, let's head out. Oh, that's perfect. We can head out, uh, save the guy, go get some research papers? Do I even care? I'm not so sure that I care. Maybe, maybe get some resources. That would be the best. June, uh, that you should be part of Team One. So Team One is is everybody who has a ranged weapon, and Team Two is Jimmy. Ah, uh, fuck that guy. Messy. We can't stop. I feel like I'm 
driving around tanks instead of people. Where's the thing that we need to save? Okay. We got you. Timmy. Uh, Timmy, just do that. We're gonna uh, stay here. Kill all the demons that are about to kill you. Don't worry, we got your back. Glenn, who's a priest? Okay, um... Go away, guys. Go home. Okay, we saved Glenn. So, what does... What is this Glenn capable of? He's a gardener, which is great. And he loves meat. Which lowers his nutrition and max energy, but makes him a lot more accurate with rifles, but a lot less accurate with melee. It gives him more armor and movement speed. What? So we can use him as a fighter or a gardener. Uh, question is, does he like doing that? Yeah, he does. So I guess he's just gonna be a farmer. Also, we might take him as a fighter. However, not sure if uh, uh, he has rifles. He does not have rifles as a specialty. Yeah, whatever. You guys just gonna do some farming. Anyway, team winner. Weapons parts. So, uh, what I need to check back home is research. I also wanted to build a mine. I can build a mine. Looks like it's not possible to build a mine. And possibly two things at the same time. Now that needs to go. If I could build a mine right there, that would be the best. Okay, uh, can I make weapon parts? How do you make weapon parts? Construction, okay, guard tower, that would be a nice one to get, I suppose. Quarry speed, composites, max health of everybody, transportation gun. Okay, I'm definitely getting ahead of myself there. Okay, nail gun. Yeah, that would be a step up. Oh, weapons workshop, right? Right click for more info. Alright, now, now we're talking. So, if I go for this uh, gun crafting tech, we definitely want more research materials. Weapon parts, yeah, 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 yeah. So we want more tech and possibly weapon parts. Okay, let's just go for metal weapons. It doesn't matter right now. We just know what we wanna aim for. Which is at least uh, one more research material. Yeah, that's doable. That's, that's on the tough side. Or we try to skip that. That's the easiest fun so far. Alright, let's scavenge that. We don't need to be risking a damn thing here. Unnecessarily. Well, that's doable as well, but we're just gonna start with the easiest fun.
Okay, not so bad. So I have a decent location. Will they come here? Oh, they did. Seth, go away! Oh, what the fuck? Okay, uh, new rule, never play uh, these fights on like double or quadruple speed. I would like to press all to resolve actually. The game is dumb. I suppose then we have to look for them because I'm either sitting around with on like double speed oh we managed to take out the ghost easy oh my god Armand Armand took a lot of damage Wait, what is that? Bourbon dream? Trade cooldown? Question mark, what is that? Uh, oh, that's another settlement. You reach the settlement where a makeshift sign tells you its name, Bourbon Dream. As you approach, you get uneasy stares from its inhabitants. Clearly, fate has not been any kinder to them than it has been to you. You introduce yourself and assure them that you mean no harm. But they are still wary. They are unwilling to let you into their camp, but offer to trade resources. Okay. RAID! Uh... Okay. Whatever. Whatever, guys. Uh, can we find some, uh... Weapon parts? How easy it is to get it? Not easy. Not easy. Enemies approaching? Get the hell back home. Eventually, I might just have to leave, uh, like a proper team back home. Not sure about uh, the warning, how much time. Are almost upon me. Yeah. Alright guys, uh, uh. What do you think about just coming over here? Holy crap. That was... That was close. Uh, Mr. Priest. Uh, do you mind fighting for your life? Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Two ghosts and a werewolf. I should have like a special place where I fight. Set, go away. What? What is that? Fuck. Okay, I can't make up any excuses to bring him back now. I just want to make progress at this point. That's, that's why it's such a bummer.
I guess Bart was a mission critical. <sighs> so, what's gonna be the... The strategy? I don't know. I don't really know what's gonna be the strategy we're gonna employ to deal with these guys. But whatever you're doing right now is obviously garbage. Uh, that should be cut down. Anyone who's uh, making that a priority? Well, okay, Stephanie, I can't really blame you for getting water now. Yeah, this is where we want to build the mine. Hmm. Not sure how to set it up. I'm thinking that I can set up a line here and they come in at the bottom. But that would require uh, quite Well, this wouldn't really provide cover, really. Mm, I don't know. I just don't know how to do it. Obviously, the spike barricades are quite expensive. Can I move the barricades or only destroy them? Yeah, I can only destroy them. Put a, well, I can't put a lock up in there because I don't have enough wood. Oh boy. So, how do we do this? It's a good question. Uh, maybe, I don't know. First of all, I need to get a lot more wood. And uh, not dying of thirst uh, is a good step. Good first step as well. So I suppose we are focusing on that. The thing is, we can't make any doors. So any kind of barricades I'm putting down uh, need, need to be destroyed. Or, or we just have, we are kind of like uh, blocking ourselves from uh, efficiently, um, I don't know, moving around. Because I can just wall this in and maybe have this little corridor here and it's gonna be good against uh, the melee guys. But the wheat farm actually provides no cover. That's not the best. But that would be a decent way to not get overrun. However, this house would need to go. I would need to move around uh, some... Move what I have inside. Which is not too bad. We can do that. Hmm.
Uh, let's just get more food first. If we're gonna do that. Water. Right, we're doing okay with water. I think at this point, I just need to... Take a step back. Go for gun crafting. Weapon workshop. Yeah. Can I make that happen? We don't have metals. That's what I'm trying to do. Get metals. Timmy and Stephanie are getting water. And it's not enough. That's basically their full time job at this point. But it's clearly not enough. Timmy is so bad. Yeah, Tom is finding it a little bit more awkward to work with the farm. Because of that bell that's kind of in the way. Yep, my bad. Leveled up. Glenn the priest. I, he's just gonna be a farmer. Meat lover farmer. Don't have training area. So we do have the health to go on a, a raid. Uh, but can we find some water? Abundant source of water. Uh, that should be easy. But it's also kind of pointless. I don't know if I wanna send out my task force just for that. Maybe the guys that are really not doing a whole lot back at home. Tom leveled up. He's getting better with the farming again. Armand is great. Uh, but I don't really need the research points right now. Rituals. Whoa! As days go by, no signs of rescue can be seen. Exhaustion and despair are starting to take their toll. Motivation is low. Survivors go about their daily routines in quiet surrender. Researchers are affected worst of all. They find it hard to concentrate and are, and are unable to make any significant breakthroughs. There must be some way to improve morale. Perhaps a feast? A celebration? Fireworks? Whoa! Feast? I don't know about the 50 drinking water. Uh, let's do the fireworks display. It worked! Spirits are higher than ever. The spark has returned to your eyes. I would prefer just a feast, but I suppose the fireworks is cheaper. More than anyone, Glenn is extremely motivated and is asking for a special assignment. Search for equipment in nearby ruins? Yeah, find us some good stuff. I don't care about supplies. What? You found an Olympic bow? Glenn ran all the way to the nearby ruins, ignoring any dangers on the way. A while later, he made his way back to the camp with a few scratches and a splendid new weapon. What the fuck? That guy is crazy. But I guess we're gonna use that. Stephanie, uh, you really like bows, right? Uh, you can use that Olympic bow. Okay, Glenn. Uh, sure. Uh, better keep an eye out for that guy. It worked out this time, but he's definitely crazy. Uh... Yeah, well, it just canceled that task. An emissary from Bourbon Dream comes running up to your base, putting on, putting all caution aside. He's clearly distressed. He claims he, their settlement is being watched by some particularly nasty groups of demons. 
Preparing to attack, they fear they won't be able to handle them all by themselves. And request your assistance with one group of demons. If you attack and defeat them, surely they will be grateful. Will they be though? I don't know. So Glenn is basically a farmer, Tom is a farmer. I don't know if I want to send out Glenn. I guess we can. Okay. Uh, where is this mission? I don't know. What? You crazy? Attack! How far away is that? Will we ever get a jeep or something? Oh, we got attacked by a group of demons. Nice one, beggars. Uh, keep going, I guess. How far away is that? That's insane. Okay. Damn. I'm really go out, going out of my way to help you guys. What is that? New enemies? L Legion. Fallen Angel. Okay. Ah, uh, damn. Uh, let's be part of Team Bum. Oh, these are melee, for the most part. Those are all melee. Glenn, what are you doing? Ah, oh, look at that. We got nothing. The people of Bourbon Dream are very grateful for your assistance. Your relationship with them has improved significantly. Well, great. Oil. Um, uh, sure. Uh, let's go back to that farm. <laughs> I don't know. I need to spend more time on my base now. Actually, that's what I would like to. What? That's not significant. I pro probably shouldn't have wasted the time with these guys. It was just too far away. Okay, auto resolve place. Okay. Auto resolve. Maybe it's not gonna be completely dumb. Fair enough. Yeah, I don't care about stones and scraps and whatnot. There's like a question mark over there. I should go to the southeast. That's where my mission is. Oh, Timmy took a lot of damage. Ooh, a leather jacket. So cool. And some tomatoes over here. Some bricks. Okay. Ah, uh, that's an easy fight as well. Some wool. 
Okay. Not sure how the auto resolve works. These are fine fights. At least acceptable ones. That's good. Yeah, just keep cleaning out the area. Oh, traders showed up in my base. Maybe let's check him out. Oh uh, boy. Sterling SMG. Elements armor. Like how rich you think I am? This is not even that good. It's very comparable to the SMG that I bought earlier. This is just twice as expensive, basically. Okay. Mm, yeah. We can always turn the hides into some uh, special jackets that we are wearing right now. And we can sell that, so that's good. Yeah, that's an easy fight as well. Plus some question mark item. Okay, then we went into the red. Another leather jacket. Okay, let's just go back home. Uh, we had enough for now. Why not? And... Metal mine. Just mineral resource. Okay, so weapon workshop. Yeah, I need to get metals. So someone is gonna be the miner here. I need to concentrate again on the base and getting some uh, upgrades. Survivors are tired. Well, go sleep. Quarry speed plus 10%. Now that's a really good one to go for. Mine speed plus 10%. We might just have to leave Armin back home because uh, research points are valuable. Composites. Yeah. But tailoring doesn't matter. Construction. Doesn't matter, really. We can make some better houses. Uh, guard tower. That that could be actually the the answer to my problem of how the fucking hell we are gonna defend our base. And maybe the answer is uh, bloody guard towers. Who knows? Could be. Could be. Um, how hard is it to get there? I don't have any research papers, which would be nice. Wait, unlocks weapon parts? Metals and copper. It's found in the desert. What? Uzi. Uzi is not even that important. 
Ha. Okay, so... Metals... I don't have to unlock the weapon parts. But, yeah, I do have to unlock it. Like, this firearm mechanics has to be unlocked. If I want that kind of weapon. You can also go for... Uh, the nail gun, which should be actually pretty good if I started actually mining. Oh, wait. We can do it now. Who done the mine? Level up! Who, who leveled the up? Scouting party? Oh. Armand leveled up. Again. Rare firearms, sniper rifles with bullseye. Plus one range. That's all very tempting. I might just... I don't know. Sniper rifles? Dark weapons. Huh. Okay. Tech weapons. Uh, let's just go for plus one range. Sure, Armand. Uh, you're a cool guy. Even detective. Oh yeah. Who's gonna mine though? Who's good at mining? Well, I guess, you know, who doesn't mind mining? So that's something. Set? Ah, oh, Set could be a decent miner. Timmy is basically useless. <laughs> Sorry, Timmy. Yeah, I guess that's all we got right now. Anyhow, this is a good time to take a break. Thanks for watching, guys, and see you next time.